Violent crime is off to a fast and deadly start in Milwaukee this year. One troubling trend is the violence co committed by young people. I recently talked with U.S. Attorney Jim Santel about the rare step his office is taking to address that problem. Carjackings, bank robbery, armed robbery, illegal guns, familiar cases in state court, but now a few of those cases have caught the interest of federal prosecutors. The recent violence has prompted a spike in that interest and therefore it's also prompted us to be a little bit more aggressive when it comes to bringing to those tools to the, the table that can address the, the violent crime issues that we have uh, identified. U.S. Attorney Jim Santel tells me those prosecution tools are not new. They're just finding ways to use them against juveniles. That is something that we don't do lightly, uh, that we don't do uh, with, uh, without a great deal of consideration, but it also underscores one of the continuing uh, problems that we have, which is more and more we're identifying young people, adolescents, involved in these horrific crimes in Milwaukee. Like this one. And I was so shocked. In April, Simone Spencer told the court about being shot in the face and having her car stolen. 17-year-old Grover Ferguson, who already had a juvenile record, was charged in state court. But now he also faces carjacking and gun charges in federal court. We are not simply selecting people because we think we're going to make an example of them. And we're taking this atypical step of sending that message once again that just because you're not 18 does not mean the federal government will not take a look at you if you engage in similar conduct. Is this a case where defense lawyers are going to be coming to you and say, oh, all of a sudden now you want to get tough and you're getting, bringing my guy into the federal court when he should be in state court? And my response to that would be, we're not getting tough. I'd like to think we've always been, to use the uh, present attorney general's phrase and the past attorney general's phrase, we're being smart on crime. We're prosecuting those people who we've identified as causing the major problems in Milwaukee. Another advantage to getting convictions in federal courts, sentences tend to be tougher than state courts.